Jacksonville Jaguars safety Andrew Wingard, 42, at Tiaa Bank Field. Corey Perrine slash Florida Times Union The Jacksonville Jaguars proved in Week 9 that actions speak louder than words. Instead of talking about not shooting themselves in the foot and how they would play better, they went on to the football field and come back from a 17-0 deficit to beat the Las Vegas Raiders. Four-year safety Andrew Wingard met with the local media Monday and talked about what the Jags did differently to end a five-game losing streak. Right off the bat, Wingard told the media it feels good to win but knows that he and his teammates can't get win drunk, we have a tough challenge this week, so we have to enjoy it today and get back on the horse next week. He went on to say that he knew the Jaguars were going to win even though they were trailing the Raiders 17-0 in the second quarter. So what did the Jaguars do differently to get over the hump in Week 9? The player known as Dewey says that messages eventually lose their effectiveness, so the team just went out there and executed. You don't like motivational speaking, Wingard said. We don't need to come in here every week and try to find some motivation of everyone saying, words really breed actions. When everyone comes in and it's like we need this, we need that, we need, need, it kind of gets redundant and it's not a good feeling. But I know for sure this week we came out and stopped talking and just started doing so. That's really what we tried to focus on throughout the course of the week. After going undrafted in 2019, Wingard signed with the Jaguars. He was mostly relegated to special teams in his rookie season but worked his way up the depth chart and eventually joined the starting lineup. The former Wyoming Cowboy beat Andre Sisco for the starting job next to Rayshawn Jenkins last year but started this season on the bench.